Hi, this is Tiffy Bean's YouTube channel. And today we're going to talk about making a short uh, video using the Vavi video editor using what we have stored on our computer. So first of all, we open the Vavi video editor and we click on import and we look for a video to import. Now this is, um, we're going to use video footage that we previously um, filmed and created a video from. So it's not a project, it's a finished, completed video, but we want to change and re-edit and reproduce that particular footage. So we go into import, go into new project to create the new project. Add media files, go into libraries, go into videos and the Vavi library and we find the video we want to work with. So today we're going to work with a um, video I made for a friend named Karen. And there we are, there I am at the beginning. This was one of the titles that I made and We've talked about making these titles in a previous video. So we drag and drop the video to the show reel. Click OK and there we can see the video we're going to work with. Now, because I want to show you how to incorporate music into making a video, we are going to turn off the sound on this video footage so there will be no sound. This is only for tutorial purposes. Uh, there's Carol um, and there's me on the ground having some Reiki. She's a holistic therapist. So yeah, we've got our video there. Now we've got to find some music. So we're going to go back to add media. And there we are, we've got some music. Now, as you can see, I've dragged and dropped it to the audio panel and it's not long enough to um, play over the entire video so I'm going to keep using it so it starts and restarts. If it sounds bumpy on playback we can fade this in and fade this out but normally it would be fine. Um, so there we're just going to add the final snippet of music. Now as you can see it's going too far beyond the end of the video so I'm going to tidy that up at the end there by dragging the marker across, highlighting the scissors above the um, time frame and making a snip and deleting the bit we don't want. There we go. Normally I should have done that at the end when we've added in fades and things like that but never mind. So normally you'd wait till probably the end to edit your music so that it covers the entire video. So I've faded that out on the last section so that it doesn't suddenly stop because it doesn't play the full track. So I've faded that out for a couple of seconds. Um, so there we've got the video, we've got some music underneath. Now we're going to add some fades and there's so many marvellous effects. So let's try one just here in between the music break. We highlight the video pane, make a snip with the scissors, click on fades. Now there's two views in my Vavi. One is your busy timeline and another is your storyboard showing you the blocks of information that you have in my Vavi. And this is a really easy way to see what you've got there or if you've got any empty clips that may need deleting. So we're going to drag in some fades Spoilt for choice, so many to choose from. I wouldn't make it too fussy with too many different styles in one video. So we're going to go for the pinwheel, which is a nice splattery one. And one I use regularly, which is the page turn left. That's always a nice one to start with. It's trial and error, what you prefer, what you like. It's your creative work. And we'll end with a different type of pinwheel. So there we are, you can see storyboard and now we're going back over to the timeline you can see that we've got two bits of video with a break in the middle and we've got our fades and our music at the bottom um, now if we did want to alter the volume of the music 
you can right click on each chunk of music or use the volume button. So now we're going to save the project in case um, it crashes. But remember to save the project frequently in case it does crash. Um, so we're saving this as work in progress, it's a video editor project. And we're going to save it as Carol 1. And click save. There we go. And then there's, we can have a look now at our effects. Um, that was the page turn. And now we're going for the pinwheel. That's the pinwheel break in the center, can you see? There we go. Look rather attractive. And then we drag the cursor about find different areas of the video we want to edit, look at, make a snip, a break. You can see the poster at the end there that we've finished with. We'll talk about this on another video. You can make your own posters instead of using the Mavavi titles. So there we go, that's the final break, the pinwheel that we've created. So there you can see all the fades that we've created for this, for this video. So we're going to save the video um, to start with as, it, as something we'd like to upload to YouTube. And that's only because that's primarily why I create videos, they go online. There's different formats. If for anything not described here, you can go to the chat uh, live chat section on the Mavavi.com website. So um, it just zoomed out so we can see everything in the panel zoom in and zoom out button certainly does make life easier especially if we want to drag small images that are only on for a few seconds that aren't always visible you'll see them if you zoom in so we're going on to file we're going to save the movie um, save as a video file if we wanted to save for YouTube we would click down to online video and it pops up their video for YouTube, we would click save. But because we've used an MP3 audio on here, um, it's it's best to save the video and tell on saving that we've used MP3. This will correct any noise uh, disturbance. So save video file. The top bar remains the same, output forum, general video. Preset, we change to H264, H264 AWC video. Um, we open up the settings box. You must remember to do this, it's very important. The second drop down box, we click check MP3. And at the bottom on the left hand side, we select progressive download. So we make two changes within that panel and click save. So we'll save as Carol 1 and general video. Now I'm not going to really save this video because it's not necessary for me to do so. I wasn't creating this as a project for myself, it was a tutorial. So I'm going to cancel save but that will play back with um, you know the nice fades and the music overlay. Um, so there you go, have a little practice, have fun, be creative and I hope this video has been useful to you. Thank you very much and please be sure to subscribe to my playlist for Mavavi and the Tiffy Beans YouTube channel. Bye bye.